So we've got Lou in the house. This is gonna be a little bit of a training camp vlog. Lewis is here for the next 10 days. We're gonna get stuck in with some hard training. We're gonna be going fast. We're gonna be putting suits on. And I thought I'd uh, vlog a little bit of the journey. Since the meet, we sort of got back to Muscat on Monday night late. Tuesday was yesterday, I had a little loosen off. He swam with the kids in the morning. Um, he's got some aerobic work done and he had that, again, done a little bit more in the afternoon. So he got two swims in yesterday. They've been down the beach this morning. We're going to do a 200 IM, three 100s. No backing down, eh, Lou? No, not today, mate. We're doing it, we're going to get it done. So if at the end of this video, we don't do all that I just said, well, you can let us know in the comments that it's not acceptable. We're going to hold ourselves accountable today. It's 54 days to the Olympic trials start in Stratford. And uh, we're going to make sure we remember that every time we look at the board, every time we're hurting a bit later today. So before we get in the pool, we're doing a little circuit in the gym. We're going some banded pull-ups. We're going some weighted chin-ups. We're going some med ball slams. We're going some single leg box jumps. We're going some band pulls in, in, in plank. Uh, gym work's done, we're going to get in for a little loosen and then we're going into our suited 200 IM. Lou reckons he's got a, a flag touch going on here. Not quite, not quite. So we've had a small change of plans. Don't, don't, don't get, don't get angry with us. We are still doing a 200 iron, don't worry, but we're gonna start with a 53 as it's our first sort of fast session in this pool. Set a benchmark for the next 10 days and see if we can then move on from that. But Lou's gonna give the carbon glide to go, which I hope you've seen the review for. If you haven't seen the review, uh, click the link up top and you'll be able to check out my carbon glide review. And I'm gonna wear the previous arena flagship, the carbon ultra, which you know I'm publicly not a fan of. So the current, most expensive suit from Arena, the Carbon Glide, and the old most expensive suit from Arena, the Carbon Ultra. So, lose 53 is to start. Take your marks. Hup. Ten seven to feet. Yep. Twenty-two nine. The swarms of locust attacking muscat. We've got one pool side here. I just fished out the pool. So Lewis Clifford going well out his comfort zone, going to two hundred iron. We said we're going to do it. We both didn't want to do it, but we're doing it. He's got good pedigree on breast and free. He's been very fast before for flies in a 24 1 for 50 fly. So he's got some fly pedigree. Backstroke, I don't think I've ever seen him swim it, if I'm going to be completely honest. He's out in 7 1. That's fairly respectable. I'd like to think he's going to work his underwater on the backstroke phase. Definitely the weakest of his four strokes. The only one he's not competed at a, at a, a high standard, a national standard for. So um, I'm sure he's hurting already. We'll see how he feels when he gets onto the, uh, the breaststroke leg. His breaststroke probably going back as his, 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 be his better stroke, I'm sure he'd say. He's been a 26-7 short course. He's out in 64-2. Some little cheer. Up! Up! He's got a fairly... Uh, I've only ever seen him swim breaststroke at a high tempo, but he looks like he's got a nice sort of glidey stroke there for a, should he be swimming a longer, longer event like this. Still got mega powerful pull downs. Yep. Listen to a lovely, lovely glide for you kids watching. Look at that. Right there. Everything's perfectly straight. His arms are stretched out, his head's dropped. Go! Up. 
Go! Yep. 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 A big kick. Where's the roll line? You kicked that roll line? No, I did not. I don't know how 200 I am. It was the most horrible experience of my life. Lou went 75. I went 18 so Fort slow. Never again. Day two of training camp. I coached this morning. Lou done some work in the gym. And I was just chilling down the beach to get lunch. And then we're going back to the pool. We're gonna do a little bit of more hundred pacey stuff today with some with some descending hundreds in there and tomorrow we're going to hit the power up it's a lovely day we're back in the pool both just loosening up before we start a little bit of hundred pace work for some sun 41 blaring i think we're going to do a little bit of technique analysis before we start the main sets so we're going to get on the bungees and get a little bit of underwater footage going on Next day, more training. Coached the kids this morning, gave them a pretty, pretty tough set of 100 pace 25s. And today we're just going quality, we're going power. Uh, we started off with 8.15s underwater, just getting ourselves going a little bit. Now we're doing some 12 and a halfs. Done the first set on form stroke. So we're pushing to 12 and a half, easy, easy to the wall back to the middle and then dead start 12 and a half into a finish. Done five of them. And now we're going to go the same thing, but from dives to 12 and a half, so basically to a breakout, um, and then again finishing hard. So that's the situation. Oh, wow. We've done our 12 and a half, there's been a little change of pan. We've done a few start practices, and we felt all right. Well, Lou felt really good. So we decided, well, we're going to put a suit on. So Lou's given the old Mizuno MX Sonics a go. I just worked on an old Carbon Air. Um, well, Lou's going to go 50. I'm going to just start with 25 and see how I feel. It's all right, uh, Lou ended up doing a 50, so I thought I've got to do a 50 as well. Uh, he went foot leave 22.70, so just over 0.2 quicker than he was a few days back, so that's positive. And great first 25 out in 10.3, um, of course, it's foot leave. I like to go and take your marks, go again. I was 24.2, I think, on, my, on Tuesday, and today I went 23.8 snuck a breath on the way back and I'm feeling really really broke broken down week one of hard training we've got the guy rustling round giving us a little bit of massage work to to finish off the week well before we have a rest day tomorrow and then hit it hard again sunday so on our rest day from swimming me brendan lewis we're going to head down and play nine holes of golf i've never actually played proper golf i've only played par three golf and then on the way i went and picked up a suit package because in oman the post office doesn't deliver. You have to go and collect your parcels 
from the post office and then pay for that service. So I've got a couple of suits in here. I'm gonna open them and see what they are. I've got a few suits from Aquafil. I've got these oxygen jammers from Aquafil. Here they are, the Aquafil oxygen. I've also got a woman's knee skin, which to be honest, barely seems like a tech suit. I would say it's not a tech suit even. I'm gonna get out and have a little look at the views. So on the way to golf, we've had a little bit of traffic jam here because there's, well, goats everywhere. Just got lunch in our go golf cart, going to the first tee. Fully licensed. <laughs> oh. Lou's in the cart behind us. Can't do the zoom in. Is he trying to overtake? He's trying to overtake us, but we've got the faster car. We've got Brent always oh, overtaking us. So we've just got to the longest hole on the course from these yellow tees, 570 yards. opportunity of the day. I should, should be able to finish that for a four though. First par of the day. Nice job Brendan. This is the finish of my first game of golf. There's a lot of shots. <laughs> so it's Saturday evening now. It's the last workout of the week. We've gone to the gym. Lou's just on the bike doing some cardio. I'm doing one of Jake's functional training programs. So the first super set I've got is 10 med ball wall throws, five on each leg of single leg box jumps. We like to stay low to the ground, 24 inches, really work on that straight leg jump. And then eight ab roll rollouts. So that's the first suit set done. I'm now moving on to the next set, which is a combination of throws, trap bar jumps, and anti-rotation band presses. Again, I'm doing three sets of all of these suit sets. So our next exercise was trap bar deadlift. Just going up the weights, sticking at five reps. Just done five reps at 152 kilos. Loaded up to 162. I'm not sure if I hit five, but we'll see what I do. Finished off with a dumbbell bench press. I've got a new PB of five reps at 45 kilos in each arm. So first week of training camp with Lewis is done. We're definitely gonna up the tempo a little bit this week and there will be another vlog for that. So if you wanna see what we get up from the second week, hit the subscribe button. Make sure you do like the video so that other people can basically see my content. And if you want to follow us on Instagram to see what we get up to there, I'm at the Swim Suit Guy 95 and Lewis is at Lucky Lewis Clifford. Thanks again for watching and I'll see you on the next one.